grab the stage and get your microphone and kind of let everybody know how, how the event kicks off with some music and everything. Thank you everybody for coming today. Thank you. All right, thank you all for being here so much. I appreciate it so much that y'all came. Happy to have you. Um, I'll first start off when I started class. I always welcome everyone. So welcome to Painting with a Twist Fair Land. Um, and then of course, during our class, we always crank up the music. So let me turn that up a little bit. There we go. And it's always a party in here, whether it's a Tuesday night or a Friday night, okay? It's always a party. We always make sure the music's up, the mood is up. Everything is just going to be awesome and fun and relaxing, and you won't have to worry about things when you walk in these doors, okay? Um, you're going to grab an apron. First thing you walk in, you grab one, put it on. Protect your clothes, okay? Nothing can ruin your night like getting some paint on your clothing, so uh, your favorite top or something. So we make sure everyone is wearing an apron. Um, and of course, we'll have it set up just like this. So I'll have, that's my name, of course, I'm Sophie. Um, and then you'll have your paints in front of you, all the colors that you will need. Um, we have brushes. We use different ones for different things. This big one would be for like the background, that yellow that you see, we would do that first. Um, and then of course this little one would be for all those little details in there, the feathers and stuff. We'll tell you how to use it, when to use it, how to wash it. We always like to nickname them sometimes. Sometimes we call them Kim and Kanye. Sometimes they're Kirby one, all right? Or it's, you know, Beyonce, Jay-Z, if it's kids, it's Dory and Nemo. Um, so we like to nickname them. And of course, um, if we're doing one like this, I'll tell you to take your brush, grab some yellow, We'll tell you to mix colors, grab different colors together. We'll put it on, tell you how to smooth it out, hold the brush. Um, everything we will explain. If you have a question, you can just yell it out. You don't have to raise your hand like kindergarten. Uh, we won't make you do that. You can get up, get food, drinks that you brought with you. We have ice and glasses out all the time. Uh, but just so you can enjoy your beverage while you're painting, and feel free to get up, walk around, look at everyone else's art, look at our art. Just have a good time, okay? And when you're not using the brushes, of course, we put them in the water. Once we're done with the background, we like to take a little break because everybody needs a break once in a while um, to let this dry. So while your painting is drying, nothing is more boring than watching paint dry, okay? So we like to play games. A lot of times we play games with the music um, throughout the class where it's name that tune or, you know, name the artist, dance, sing, do some karaoke. If you have enough liquid courage, Sometimes you'll get up here and dance for us, and we love that. We've had conga lines going through the whole studio before. A lot of fun. Um, and that was one of our private parties in the big church group. They were they were really fun. Um, and after it's dry, of course, we will do some of the feathers. We'll finish up the details, um, and then we'll sign it with a sharpie or with the brush. Um, and we'll just make sure you're happy with it. Of course. If you just want to relax and not worry about how it turns out too much, we do have SOS. Um, and we do that once a month. And we always talk about our classes during it, just so that you know um, that's our guarantee that you will love your painting, OK? Um, we do kids' classes. Y'all can see the cute little kids ones over here. Most of the time, if it's a divine shape for kids or adults, it's always drawn out. We sketch it out. We create a stencil. I actually have this one here. It's kind of silly, but it helps us do each one the same. We like to say it's not a drawing class, it's a painting class. So we teach you to paint, we let you have fun without being stressed out about the actual shape. Um, so consider us if you have kids, 6 to 12, if you want a private party for 12 or more, um, or if you just want to have a really awesome time by yourself, or with some friends, or with a big group of friends. Um, we love it when the place is filled up, all right? Um, I'll just show you a little bit of the feathering and stuff, and then I guess I'll hand it back to Dawn. All right, so if we mix like blue and white. We would teach you how to do something like that, green and white. And we just add on and add on until it becomes just like this one. But of course, everyone puts their own twist. It will be unique, okay? It will be your creation. Even though you have the stencil and everything, it is going to look like you did. It is going to be yours, okay? And that's the benefit of this. To 
is nothing better than hanging something in your house and knowing that you painted it. Okay, it's, you didn't buy it from Walmart or anything else. You painted it um, and you put it up and when people come in and admire it, you can say, I did that. I'm an artist now, okay? No better feeling in the world, all right? All right, I think I'll hand it back to Donna. things can be done with this and um, I do want to say um, we're going to have to take it out of here but Carol was absolutely wonderful to us and I don't know if you looked in the last couple of months and went up and down the halls at the chamber but that was all of our art that was in there and Sophie and our other lead artist AJ set all of that up and we really really do appreciate it and we are not a sales place you can't come here and buy art. We don't collect, you know, sales tax. We're really under art education if you look at, you know, what we do and how we're taxed because we don't pay tax that way. So, um, with that, Carol loves this rooster. Does so he want to take it out of there? So, we, we would like to give Carol this rooster in appreciation for, uh, for having us at the chamber and hosting us for a couple of months and letting right. everyone see our art. So thank you very much, Carol. Thank you. We'll make the note Who did that? Here, do you want to get it? Uh, Donna, do you want to get in the picture? Did you know that Carol's a real rooster person? Oh, oh sure. yeah. 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 Everything's rooster. I love, I'm glad we came here. It, don't you think it's much better than that? I mean, I, I've enjoyed the ones that have talked about.